The Excel Skills Reporter is an Excel workbook that will quickly test your knowledge and level of efficiency in using Microsoft Excel. It requires you to complete a number of Excel tasks. It will time you as you complete these tasks. It will then auto-correct and analyze how you completed these Excel tasks. And finally, it will create a personalized report on your Excel skills and level of efficiency. It will give you a mark for Excel efficiency and a mark for your Excel skills and knowledge. This workbook has been programmed and created by OnlineExcelTraining.co.uk, who are the creators of one of the UK's most popular online Excel courses, Workplace Excel. The Excel course covers Excel from beginners to advanced level, including pivot tables. This CPD certified Excel course helps you learn Excel quickly as it concentrates on the main Excel concepts, techniques, functions and formulas that you need to succeed in the UK workplace. It comes with full live chat and email support as you study it. Let's have a look at how to use the Excel Skills Reporter. First of all, you need to fill in your first name and your surname here. The company field here and the department field are optional. So I will type in Joe here as the first name and Soap here as the surname. I will leave the other fields empty. When that's done, click begin the test. This will bring you onto the first screen, which is task one. The first thing to do is read the task carefully. Understand what you have to do. In the worksheet below, you need to calculate the total sales for each city. So we need to scroll down the worksheet and do the total sales for each city. Let's go back up to the task. Then format all the values in the worksheet to the US dollar to no decimal places, and then work out the overall total sales for all cities. Now, take your time understanding the task. When you understand the task, then click the Start Task button here. This will start the timer. And note there is a maximum time allowed to complete each task, i.e. to completing this worksheet. For this task, Task 1, you have three minutes to complete this worksheet. So, you scroll down and you complete the worksheet based on what you've been asked to do. Here we're watching the total sales for this city, so I can auto sum this and I can copy it down. And you will continue on doing what the task requires. Now when you've finished completing this worksheet, then it's important to click the finished button. This will stop the timer. Then you can take your time to fill in the answers to these questions over here. These questions will be got from your completed worksheet. When you have completed the answers here, or as many as you can, click the Next Task Command button, and this will bring you on to your next task, Task 2. And again, you repeat the process. Take your time, understand what the task is asking you to do. When you're ready to complete the worksheet below, click the Start Task button. When you've completed this worksheet, click the Finished Command button. This will stop the timer. Remember that if you take longer than the maximum time allowed, the task will time out. Finally, fill in the required answers to the questions over here. When you have done that, click Next Task button for the next task. Continue on and eventually you'll get to the last task, and after you've completed that worksheet and you've filled in the answers here, then you can click Create Your Report button. This will start the process where the workbook will auto-correct your answers and analyse how you've completed the worksheets. It will then create a personalised report outlining your Excel weaknesses and strengths. It will award you a mark for Excel efficiency and a mark for Excel knowledge, giving you feedback on each task and what you need to do to improve your Excel skills. So now, it's processing all the data the methods you used in completing the tasks and the answers you gave, and we have our report. It's telling you over here what the task was checking for, and over here your results for each question. And here you have feedback on each individual question and what you need to do to improve. As you scroll down the report, it will give you feedback for each of the tasks that you have completed. Here it will give you the marks awarded for your Excel efficiency, and the marks awarded for your Excel knowledge. You can create a PDF version of the report by clicking the PDF version button and it will start to create a PDF report for you. And here we have your own personalised report of your test. 
The maximum time allowed for this test is 20 minutes and the workbook works on all versions of Excel. You can, at any time during the test, reset the test by clicking on the Name Worksheet. On this worksheet, we have the Reset button. By clicking it, it will delete all the tasks and all the answers you have completed, and it will allow you to restart the test from the beginning. We hope you enjoy the Excel Skills Reporter, and that it will improve your Excel skills.